What is up guys and welcome back to another Instagram tutorial. Today it's going to be something different because I have just uploaded this picture right here on my Instagram account. Most of you guys often ask me after I post it on Instagram for a tutorial on how to recreate this look. So this is what I'm going to do right now. I will show you how I created this look. Here's a little before and after and it's a I think a pretty cool spring vibe so it really fits to the season that we have right now. So if you want to follow along feel free to join me in this tutorial today. Now if you have any questions at all as always feel free to DM me on Instagram at Stephen Womack is my handle. I'm always open for conversation and really excited to hear from you guys and of course subscribe to the channel and hit the notifications bell if you like these kind of mobile uh, Lightroom tutorials because I will be uploading more and more of these on my channel. Now if said enough let's jump right into the free Lightroom app and I'll show you how I created this look so the first thing we're gonna do of course is open the picture in the free Lightroom app this was the picture the original picture and then we go to lights and curve on the upper right side and here I've just created a really simple s curve so the shadows on the bottom left we're gonna pull them down a little bit and increase the highlights on the upper right side a little just to create more contrast then we're done here and we're gonna even add more contrast, so we boost that up to plus 13, pull down the highlights to negative nine, pull down the whites as well to negative 16, and pull down the blacks all the way to negative 22 right here. Then we're done in the lights, we go over to colors. What you wanna do here is actually just pull down the saturation a little to around negative maybe 25, and we already, or negative 23, and we already see that uh, cool desaturated vibe that we want then we go up hit grading right here and what you want to do for the shadows here is just pull the hue to around 140 that area right here this green area and then the saturation we want to boost that up to around 12 right here to add some green to the shadows this always makes it look really vintage and kind of gives it a film vibe so we're done here in the grading the next thing we do is hit mix right here and go to the orange tones on top and what you want to do is just pull down the luminance a little bit to negative 17 just to give me some more tan right here in the skin also I feel that it's kind of green um, the skin right here so we're gonna pull that over towards that orange side a little more negative 10 on the hue and then we're gonna jump to the yellow tones here and we just want to pull down the saturation on the yellow tones maybe to negative 45 and this is gonna in the background you see those um, stone walls and that's just gonna desaturate that a little bit then we're done here and the last thing we want to do is just add some grain so we go to effects here and just boost up the grain to around 33 right here and we are already done and this is it guys this is how i edited this picture i hope you're happy with this edit i think it's a really cool kind of spring vibe it desaturates it makes it look really high quality i hope you enjoyed this tutorial also make sure to check me out on instagram at steven womack is my handle show some love to this picture if you like this one and of course if you have any questions always feel free to dm me there at steven womack is my handle as i said of course subscribe to this channel as well hit the notifications bell to not miss out on any of my future videos and of course you can always tell me me new requests let me know what you're thinking about maybe there's some new idea for me to do a new video about for you guys so always feel free to let me know now thank you so much for your love the support that i'm getting from you guys really means a lot to me and i hope i'll see you in the next video until then stay creative stay healthy peace